Hello Capricorn, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So this is your reading for the month of November. This is a general reading, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. In this reading, we'll see what is your energy, what you need to know, what is the energy of your person, what are the general messages and what are the love messages you need to know. There is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in the uh, description box and comment section. Alright, I'm shuffling the cards. I'll lay them down and then we'll see what you need to know. So we have Eight of Pentacles. Two of Cups. The Knight of Cups. The Queen of Wands, the Page of Swords, then we have uh, Four of Cups, okay. Bottom of the deck, we have Five of Swords, Capricorn. You might be dealing with Sagittarius, you might be dealing with Pisces, Cancer, uh, Virgo, if the sign pops up, all the better. Let's not remain fixed on the signs. I think, Capricorn, uh, love is happening. But love is happening when you're not expecting it to happen. I mean, you will be pretty much busy into something else. Okay, probably very likely in your career, busy making money. Okay look at this card okay he is looking down at this pentacle he is extremely hyperly focused on this pentacle he is trying to build uh, wealth for he's trying to create wealth for himself and bang on then we have two of cups okay so someone is coming towards you but uh it's 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 gonna happen when you're not expecting it to happen when you will be neck deep into something else Okay, if you're chasing love at that point of time, love is not going to happen. When you won't be chasing, you won't be thinking about love at that point of time, love is going to happen. And uh, whoever is coming towards you uh, probably is a destined partner, someone that uh, universe wants you to be with this person. There is going to be that equal give and take, very satisfying love where... Uh, I mean, instantly you will draw comparisons between this new person and people from the past. Okay, instantly you will feel like the peop people from the past, your excess, they were never so committed or never so devoted towards the connection or never so devoted towards working on the connection. Whereas this person will be from day one itself, you will notice that this person is working really hard towards this connection. Uh, really their intentions are to make this connection work okay so that will be uh, very satisfying for you otherwise it was one man show for you you were the only person who was responsible to to run the relationship and now that you are attracting a lot of attention there is likely uh, uh, there is a likely possibility that someone from the past is also coming towards you. There is a strong possibility that someone from the past is also trying to show interest in you. You might get a text message or you might get a call from uh, someone from the past. But I strongly feel like you are this evolved person. Okay. And uh, you know what is right what is wrong for you you know where do you want to spend your energy you know and you you value your energy a lot you value everything about yourself a lot and you don't want wrong people to drain you you don't want wrong people to take away uh, what you have created for yourself after a long time you have healed yourself after a long time um, you are getting in touch with your higher self and you don't want those energies or those people to distract you or take away things from you or take away the world that you have created for yourself okay there is someone who is stalking you i think so whoever is coming towards you romantically initially this person will stalk you a lot 
probably they are going to stalk you through social media or probably they might stalk you uh, in person as well if this person is stalking you in person then this is someone from your workplace so you might have met this person at work or through work uh For some of you, promotions are likely or maybe your higher-ups are going to notice that you are such a diligent person, you are such a hard-working person and you're so focused towards your work and you're so uh, dedicated and hard-working. And I think so a lot of appreciation is coming towards you from the higher-ups if you're a 95 person. And even if you are a business person, if you're self-employed, I think so you are getting some good testimonies from your customers. Okay, so... I strongly feel like the month of November is a month where you will get a lot of appreciation from various stakeholders, be it your bosses, the management, or be it your customers, maybe for some of you, uh, your friends as well. For some of you, if you are long working on your body, for a very long time you're working on your body, you're hitting the gym, you're taking care of your dietary needs and you're making sure that you're indulging into healthy diet and etc. etc. If for long you're taking care of your health, you will see some noticeable results. Okay, That uh, it, it will be very much visible. Uh, your, your efforts will lead to uh, visible and noticeable results. That's what I'm getting. And you will be very happy with the way you as a person, you are evolving. Okay. You will be also very happy uh, with the progress that you will see in your personality. For many of you, I also see that you're going to change your wardrobe. You will do a lot of shopping or maybe there is some changes that you will undergo as far as your uh, personality is concerned maybe you're going to go for a haircut or you might go for some tattoo art or you might do some piercings and etc but there are some visible changes that you are making in yourself for many of you i do feel like haircut is happening or hair color is happening or tattoo art for sure at least some of you are going to go for that and it's going to be a big one that's what i'm getting um uh, people who are not in touch with you Okay, but who have received a lot of favors from you in the past, but now you have held yourself back. All those people are missing you a lot. And all those people are missing your energy a lot. Okay, you were a big time giver in the past, Capricorn. But uh, I, I think so you're holding yourself back now. Okay, and all those who were accustomed to receiving from you are now missing you and missing you for, for the very same reason that they no more are receiving anything for, from you. And that's why they are missing you. Uh, likely that this person, these, these same people might pop up in your life all over again in the month of November. But you are in no mood to entertain anyone from the past. That's what I'm getting. Okay, so you are going to dismiss a lot of people. You do have a lot of romantic options. Okay, you do have a lot of romantic options. For some of you, travel is very likely and I do feel like it's going to be an international travel. Either you're going to travel in the month of November or you might schedule a vacation that might happen in the month of December. But the planning and everything will happen and booking and everything might happen in the month of uh, November that's what I'm getting okay all right I hope this resonates hit like share and subscribe comment down below link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you and action they will take towards you and likely conclusion between you and this person all right take care have a great time and bye bye Capricorn